can you still be called a carnivore? He's fake carnivore. Uh, yeah, I mean, I thought about the same thing. I was like, should I change my name? And I was like, look, are we really <laughs> going to be that? Are we going to split hairs here? I don't even talk about, quote unquote, a carnivore diet anymore. But I have heard people say, you know, when Andrew was on Joe's podcast recently, he says, Joe, I know you eat fruit as part of your carnivore diet. And he's like, <laughs> okay, look, I'm running with it. I just want people to benefit. I call yeah. it animal-based now. I think that that's a better term to be organs, either fresh or desiccated, meat, fruit, honey, raw dairy. That's what I think is animal based. That's what I'm much more a fan of. George St. Pierre messaged me a while ago and he said, Hey, I want to do the carnivore diet. And I said, include fruit in the diet. And Andrew Huberman says he's going to do carnivore. And I say, yeah, include fruit. And he goes, yeah, that's what I mean. I'm going to include fruit on my carnivore diet. So <laughs> I think that like there is some degree of dogmatism and we don't really need to split hairs here. Like if animal based is a better word, we should call it that. But I've been carnivore and D my whole career in the space. I'm just going to stay that. And if people want to be like, he's an omnivore, I'm like, fine. Like, what do you, what's your point? 